Hello! So, it's been two weeks since I've been in Fukui, three weeks total in Japan. Um, training week, uh, the first week went pretty well, it was very terrifying. Uh, definitely got good feedback um, in learning everything. You obviously don't immediately know what you're doing, so going through those steps in training really helped. Um, uh, my biggest things that I have to work on are confidence and being energized and conveying, making everything much more fun in the classroom. I just feel so nervous, like trying to remember all the steps of everything to do. But um, it's it's coming along. My my shadow week, the second week, went pretty well, but it, it was really hot in the room uh, because it was me and then the person who was training me and then whatever kids. Even if there was one kid, if we didn't turn on the air conditioning. God, it was so warm. <laughs> but um, I also, like my, I would teach one lesson one day, two lessons the next, three, and then four on the Saturday. And um, they went pretty well, and I still got really good feedback. And now, having done my third week in Japan, my second week at my school, um, I'm warming up to the kids more. They're kind of warming up to me, and they call me Sky Sensei, which is nice. Um, and so they're starting to sort of get in tune with who I am, I'm getting in tune with who they are, and um, I'm still, it's going to be probably another couple months to really solidify everything and make sure that, you know, I need to learn like some really good classroom management skills and also how to keep things fun. A couple of my students um, one of our vocabulary words was sing gospel music, and I ran around the room singing gospel music and clapping my hands, and it was really fun. So it's really nice and rewarding to finally get these kids to laugh and build a good like rapport with them. It's, it's going pretty well. It's very, very, very hard, very tiring. My hours are from 12 to 9 every day, and Saturday from 10 to 7, and... Um, when I come home, it's very, I'm very exhausted and trying to stay awake because I have to wake up later. Um, uh, like the whole first couple weeks I was waking up extremely early and I was dead by <laughs> like two or three hours in. So that was very hard. Um, Japan so far is great. I've been taking the bus and exploring a lot. Yesterday I rode for um, eight, about eight to eight and a half kilometers, which is roughly like, I don't know, maybe six or seven miles. I don't know how these conversion things work, but uh, riding my bike was very fun and hard. And today, riding my bike to the store to go grocery shopping and buy new headphones was very tiring. And then riding home in the rain, I ride a lot in the rain, um, but I signed up for it. Um, so I don't mind. It's very nice. Um, Fukui is very Inaka, but it's still also very city, but I find it very difficult to find good music CDs and movies and things. And there's, I've been to two of the three or four book-offs in my area. Um, I went to uh, Toys R Us to try and find a Nintendo Switch, and they're still, they're all sold out here in Japan too, or at least in Fukui. Um, but that's okay, because I need to save my money anyways. Um else. Um, getting adjusted to a new apartment is very weird. Um, I finally have internet. It was luckily during my first week, but it still took a few a few days even into my, I think it was like one or two days into my, me teach, me, uh, me being the only teacher. Um, it took a couple days to get my portable Wi-Fi thing. It looks like this. Um, so it was very hard without my own Wi-Fi in my room. Um, it's not the fastest in my room, but it works, and I can stream things. Um, a couple pro tips if you move to Japan or come to Japan and travel. Amazon Prime won't work unless you have an Amazon Japan account. But Amazon Prime in Japan is cheaper. It's about uh, $35. It's uh, 3,900 yen for the year, but you get the 30-day free trial. So I use that for watching Unsolved Mysteries. Um, Hulu doesn't work, so you have to sign up for a Hulu Japan account, but I canceled mine altogether, 
because Netflix has the better options for me and it loads faster. The Hulu page loaded really slow, but that's just my personal thing because of my Wi-Fi. I didn't want to sign up for like real internet with like a router and things because I also need a mobile thing for my phone because the data plan that I'm going to be on, and that should be coming on the 18th, that is um, 3 gigs of data. And, which is fine, or I could have done the 7, but I do a lot of stuff on my phone and download stuff on my computer. So, um, I mean, I, sh I would have both, but I also don't know, you know, really how much my monthly costs are going to be. And right now, um, I pay first and last month's rent on my first paycheck, so that's going to be substantially low. So I get paid on the 25th, so we'll see how, how much that is. Um, what else? Oh my god, it's been like six minutes. Um, this is just a big catch-up video, I guess. Um, what else is going on? I realized that I brought too many clothes, so when they say only bring about five suits, maybe only bring five suits. Uh, but I brought a lot of shirts, so it's good to mix and match, and it's really nice to not have to... Uh, uh, I still have to do laundry, because the laundry is really small, so I do laundry once or twice a week if I, if I can, but um, storage for everything is kind of small, but I didn't know coming into this, so um, what else? Another pro Japan tip. Another pro tip. Oh, if it looks like it's gonna rain outside, it probably will, so please take an umbrella. Um, and you'll, if you ride a bike as well, you'll learn to become really adept at riding with an umbrella. I'm still not adept at it, so I've been <laughs> riding and almost crashing into people on a daily basis, but I smile and then they smile, and I know deep down that they just want to kill me. But it's okay. Um, yeah, so everything is, is going well. Um, I'm still having a lot of fun. Um, I bought some Japanese books, and my coworker is letting me borrow a book for kanji so I can start studying more because, oh god, you really have to know kanji here. Um, so I'm going to be doing that a lot. Um, yeah. So, everything is going well. Good to check in. Hopefully you guys like the uh, random pictures and videos and stuff that I've been posting. If you'd like to follow any of the pictures, um, please follow me on Instagram at SkySensei. Um, I have to approve it. Or follow me on Twitter. And I share things there at SkySensei. Subscribe to the channel if you want. Um... Yeah, it's, yeah, do the things. So, thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Um, to come in, this was the first thing that I saw. Sky, welcome to Fukui. Um, the person that I shadowed drew that and lived here before me. We got my washer machine. Dry my clothes outside. That's new. Toaster oven. Oh, my little refrigerator, trash, some rice cooker, under trash, more trash. I don't know how to really separate the trash just yet, but I just went grocery shopping. Um, this is my window, what it looks like outside. Right now it's raining pretty hard. I just got home from grocery shopping and riding my bike in this, and it was not fun at all. But the cherry blossoms just fell um, like two days ago or something, and they just had a festival. Today's Monday, so they had the big festival for the past like two weeks. Uh, so this is my view with my big balcony that only I have. I'm just going to keep this open because it's hot. Got all my nice clothes. Oh, my bathroom. There's my little toilet. No bidet. 
Oh well. And then this is my main living space. It's still very messy, so I have to clean my futon on the floor. I know you're supposed to pick it up after you wake up every morning, but I was lazy and I will do it sometime. Um, my TV, it's kind of outdated. I'm going to buy a new one. Uh, my kotatsu that I use. Um, oh, my bathroom, or my shower, uh, with my sink that also has the water that doubles for the shower part. And you don't use a shower curtain because why do you need one in here? When you close this little thing. Oh, so exciting. Nice. Um, we have all my clothes in these drawers. My limited space for things. I kind of want to get a bigger bookshelf. Um, my little Ghibli things. My only piece of wall art is a birthday card. Um, what else? Oh, here's my other balcony where I dry clothes and luckily this morning I pulled them out from last night thinking it would rain. But also outside we have a nice little park where kids scream at 9 in the morning and wake me up almost every day. It smells so good. But I don't know if you can see out that far with the GoPro's lack of zoom. But I just did my first real shopping trip. That doesn't count the first time that the company paid for some food. Um, so I just did my first real shopping trip. So let's see what I bought because it might be exciting to you. I don't know. Let's check. I got some tea. It was uh, 188 yen. I got some taco Doritos. Very excited. I got this for dinner. Some salmon. How exciting. Got some bananas. They're kind of expensive. Fruit and veggies are kind of expensive here. I got some of these barbecue uh, scone, scone things. They look like little fries or something. Um, I got chicken and some beef underneath in there. I got some uh, noodles to make udon, and then I got some tofu, or something, something, I don't know, it was an excellent tofu, um, some yogurt, very cheap, some curry, Mushrooms, because I'm in love with mushrooms. Ugh, mushrooms. I got some strawberry yogurt, and I'm running out of space to put all this now with all of my trash. Um, got some udon for when I'm too lazy to boil a pot of water. Some garlic for the chicken. Some oregano, probably for the chicken, and maybe the steak. I didn't really think about it too much. Some little carrots, these are so cute, so... Oh. Ninjin. And some cocktails, my favorite kind of cocktails. They're like 3% alcohol, so I'm gonna get wasted. Just kidding. Orange. Uh, grape something, probably grapefruit, more grapefruit, and peach. So, these are what I bought. I'm an adult, I promise. And there's trash, and there's more trash. Oh, and this is really good for udon, and you can, this stuff lasts forever. So yeah, that's what I got on my first real shopping trip. Yeah.